In your vote 2024, former President Donald Trump making two stops in Michigan today. This afternoon, the Republican nominee stopped by a manufacturing facility in West Michigan. And later today, Trump will be in Warren for another town hall event. Our David Sackrider joins us in the studio now. David, this visit marks Trump's 10th Michigan trip this year. That's right, Terry, and the frequency of those events only seems to be ramping up the closer we get to Election Day. Local partisans say that not only underscores the importance of the Great Lakes state to this election, but it also energizes organizers here at home. Having um, having him come in, it's a huge boost for morale and um, and it's also just good for them to know, hey, he sees us like he knows that we're working hard for him and that really excites them. 8th District Republican Chair Ann Delisle says that energy was especially true when the former president visited Flint last week, his first visit to the city since 2016. For the last year and a half, as the district chair, I have been submitting requests to the Trump Organization through different channels and asking him to come to Flint because I really believe for many races that the path for Michigan is going to come through Flint. Um, so this was huge. On the other side of the aisle, Vice President Kamala Harris has not been to Michigan with the same frequency. Since taking over at the top of the ticket in July, she's only been to the state three times, all of them in the Detroit area. Um, I know there's some talk where we would like to have her visit, obviously, um, but I think there's also an added level here that she is a city and vice president. Um, so with Secret Service and all of those things, I think we as you know, local Democrats understand there's an added level of complexity when Kamala Harris visits. Genesee County Democratic Party Chair Ashley Prue says as the days tick closer to the election, the lack of vice presidential visits is not hurting the local party. We're seeing a lot of engagement right now. It's really the busiest I have seen the county party since I became chair three years ago. Both Delisle and Prue say there is a benefit for all members of a party when the top of the ticket comes to visit. The more interest in Donald Trump or Kamala Harris, the more likely those people will come out to vote and support other candidates down the ballot. In studio, David Sackreiter, ABC 12 News.